Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we're going to open our Teletubbies nesting dolls and we're going to do it outdoors in the grass. We have four dolls and our smallest is Poe, but Poe does not open. It's just the center of our nesting dolls, but we're going to open Lala. We hear something inside. Something very tiny. It's a little miniature hammer. Time to open Dipsy. I hear something inside. It's a little tiny wooden block. It has a yellow O on one side and a red letter Y on the other side. Okay, time to open Tinky Winky. Mmm, I know what this is. It's a picture of Sleepy from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs and it's a Chocolate! Yummy! Let's unwrap the chocolate and take a look. Ooh. Let's take a bite of the chocolate. Mmm, so yummy. Thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today our Teletubbies toys are sitting on our wooden fairy nesting eggs. There's a little surprise in each egg. We're gonna start with opening the biggest egg first, Poe's egg. And there's a beautiful fairy with a white skirt and red wings. Look what's inside, Poe. It looks like a little green cabbage. I know what it is, oops, oh my goodness. The egg slipped out of my hands. I'm so sorry, Teletubbies toys. Okay, back to our little surprise. It's called the Little Sprouts Cabbage Patch Surprise. This is a real baby Cabbage Patch doll. She's got bright green eyes and a little white diaper. And the Cabbage Patch dolls smell so good, just like a real baby. Inside each cabbage is a little animal and a doll, either a bigger doll or a baby. Oh, and it looks like we got another baby tiny fans and a puppy dog. The little baby has a pink outfit and the dog has a little pink tag on its collar. These are very similar to the little sprout surprise we opened earlier with the Teletubbies. They're like twins. Our baby's name is Colette Sarah and her puppy's name is Sadie. It's time for Lala to open her egg. She has the next biggest egg. It's a soft green pouch. There must be something inside. Look, Lala, it's treasure. Two golden coins, a green jewel, and a blue stone. Dipsy's going to open his egg now. It's green just like him and there's a little fox on the outside. Oh, it's an eraser and it says something. L-O-V-E. It spells love. I tell my family members that I love them every day. It's very important. Love makes us happy. 
Now it's time for Tinky Winky to open his egg. It has a little white bunny rabbit on it. Oh, it looks like another egg. A very teeny tiny egg. It has a green fairy with red and pink wings. But this egg doesn't open. It's the middle of our nesting eggs. And look who stopped by to have a little nap. It's Kitty. We love you, Kitty. And we also love you, Tiny fans. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we have activities inside our Yo Gabba Gabba nesting dolls. Our family doesn't play video games, but we play lots of fun games and activities like Frisbee. Oh, there's little hearts. It's the perfect size for our dolls. Let's count the hearts in French. En français. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, six, sept, huit, neuf. Neuf. Nine hearts. And here we have our paddle ball. I used to have one of these when I was a kid. See how many times you can hit the ball. It's quite tricky, especially with this tiny paddle. How about we head outside with Muno and we try out our mini Frisbee. Let's see if it can go as far as a large Frisbee. Ooh, not quite. Now it's time to open our pink fufa. What activity is inside here? Ooh, it's a Rubik's Cube. A good brain game for a rainy day. It has many different colors on each side. Let's say the colors in French. Let's start with blanc, white, vert, green, Jean, yellow, bleu, blue, rouge, red. Orange, orange. Time to open our yellow plex. What activity is inside? Oh, what? Pink ice cream cones. Do you know what this is, tiny fans? It's actually a little mini skipping rope for dolls. And it has ice cream cones as handles. My kids love to skip. Skipping is a great way to get exercise. Hmm, I don't know if I can get one of my dolls to skip, but I do have my wind up skipping monkey toy. Now we open blue tootie. Here is another activity I used to play when I was a kid. It's called jacks. Every time you bounce the little ball, you pick up one of these little jacks. It's actually a real bouncy ball. Let me give this a try. Pick up the ball. Oh, I picked one up, a pink one. That seemed pretty easy. Let's try it again. Oh, didn't work that time. That bounced. Oh, it's quite hard. I was very lucky the first time. That's how you play jacks and you can play with a friend. Finally, we have our little green doll, Broby. Hi, Broby. You're so little and cute. Oh, look, it's a little tiny gumball machine. 
Now this might not be a game, but it's something the kids play with in the dollhouse. They have a wooden tree dollhouse set and it keeps them busy for hours. My kids get many more memories and enjoyment by playing games with family instead of video games. What would you want to play with your family? And thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we have a new toy called Penguin Parade with six nesting penguins. So it's a family of penguins. Let's open it up and play with them. All right, so we've opened up our penguin and all the little penguins are inside. Now something about penguins, they are a marine bird. Their wings are not for flying, but they serve as uh, powerful paddles. And they spend most of the time in icy waters. Okay, oh my. Well, the first penguin seems to be wrapped up like a little mummy. Let's unwrap it like a little present. And here is the mummy penguin. Oh, and the next one is wrapped as well. This is to protect them from not getting scratched. So we get to unwrap each little penguin like a little present. So here is the first baby penguin. So we have, so far, one, two, three penguins. So that means we have three more to unwrap. This is our next baby penguin. Hello, little penguin. Oh, and they're just getting tinier and tinier. So, number two penguin. There we go. And now number one penguin. There's this tiniest little penguin. Look at how tiny that little penguin is. So cute. So it's a family of six penguins. And we're just going to unwrap our little baby. And our little baby. Oh, and the baby is sleeping. Just like babies like to sleep. So does a little baby penguin. And this little baby penguin opens, but there's not a smaller penguin inside. And there is our family full of one, two, three, four, five, six penguins. Thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we're outside with Poppy and Eagle Piggle. And we've been raking leaves into piles. There's a pile over by the slide. There's another pile behind the swing set and a big pile here with red and yellow leaves. Eagle Piggle spots something in the leaf pile. It looks quite familiar. Red with blue stitching. Let's pull it out of the leaf pile and see what it is. It's an Eagle Piggle box. And it's in the shape of a square. Let's open it up and see what's inside. It's another box, but this one has upsy daisy on it and it's round. The side is yellow with pink upsy daisy flowers. Oh, I definitely hear something shaking around inside. Oh, this lid doesn't pull off, it slides to the side. And this time there's an egg-shaped box with Maka Paka and his Og Pog. Let me see if I can pull this box out of here. Hmm. I'm going to tip this upside down. And there we go. Oh, wow! It's bowling pins with a little mini blue bowling ball. Perfect for our toys. Let's go bowl with Upsy Daisy and Macapaca. 
Come on, puppy. I've set up the bowling pins. There are usually 10 pins in a bowling game. Upsy Daisy's going to bowl first. Each toy will only get one turn. Upsy Daisy has hit three pins down. If you hit all of the pins down in one turn, it's called a strike. It's Macapaka's turn. Macapaka has hit four pins. He is now in the lead. Let's reset. And finally, it's Eagle Piggle's turn. Oh, we have a new spectator. It's Kitty. Okay, Kitty, please have a seat. And Eagle Piggle can have his turn. How many pins did Iggle Piggle knock down? Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six. Bowling is a fun activity that you can do with your family. We love to bowl together. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Tiny Treasures and Toys. Please subscribe. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. We have four Sesame Street nesting eggs and there are gonna be some surprises inside some of them. The smallest one is red and it's Elmo. He has a little pink heart right at the bottom because love is important. Connecting with people is important. I hug my kids every single day. And on the back is a picture of Elmo's favorite toy. It's baby David. Elmo doesn't open up. So we'll move on to the next egg and it's green. Who is it, tiny fans? It's Oscar the Grouch. And he has his little worm slimy on the bottom, as well as some shapes. We have a circle and this shape has five sides. So it's called a pentagon. Next, we have a rectangle, oval, triangle, and square. And let's have a look on the back. Oh, there are two triangles. You can sort of see the surprise. Let's open it up. And we have a little mini box of crayons because Oscar the Grouch loves to color. I love to color and make a rainbow with my crayons. And here we have Cookie Monster. Um, um, um. Oh, and he's, of course, got a cookie on the back with numbers. We're going to count together, tiny fans. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Maybe Cookie Monster had ten cookies. He has a square shape in the bottom of his egg. And the surprise is a little miniature glow worm. You may have seen this in some other videos. We push his chest and his face glows. And he's so soft and fuzzy. So cute and so tiny. Our last egg is yellow Big Bird. And he has his brown teddy bear. And I see some letters. There's A to E. And on the other side, it's V to Z. But where's the rest of the alphabet? There it is on the back side. And there are circles. And we have another surprise. You can peek. Let's open up the egg. And it's another glow worm. And guess what, tiny fans? This one is really old and it glows in the dark. So I need to go into a dark room and see if he still glows. <gasps> and only his face glows. Oh, and the tip of his hat, the pom-pom. I love glow-in-the-dark toys. Okay, tiny fans, it was hide-and-seek time. Did you see the Dora backpack hiding somewhere earlier in the video? Hope you had fun today. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. 
Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we're going to open our In the Night Garden Tom Boo's Nesting Dolls. These are very old toys and there are some surprises inside. Ooh, there's a pill bug. He's walking by. I wonder where he's going today. He's heading towards the edge of the step. Hmm, do you think he will go down off of the step? Oh, no, he's just going to stay on the edge. All right, let's get back to our toys. And we're going to open two of the tomblyboos. And the reason we're only opening two is because this little tomblyboo doesn't open. Tomblyboo! Which one should we open first? Oh, I've spotted another little bug. This time it's a little ant. And he's checking out our red tomblyboo. Did you know there are 12,000 different ant species in the world? So I can't tell you what kind of ant that is. Here's Tombly Boo Eee! What's inside Tombly Boo Eee? Oh. Oh. This is from a lupin flower. It's a petal. Well, it's a few petals. And lupins can grow in all different colors purple, yellow, pink, white. I have one growing in my yard and it's pink and white. And I recently saw lupins growing down by the water. They were beautiful purple. Some were all purple and some were purple and white. And as you can see, there is a big bumblebee on them, pollinating. Bumblebees prefer flowers that are purple, yellow, pink and blue. Now it's time to open Tombly Boo Un, the biggest Tombly Boo nesting doll. What's inside? Let's pour it out. Ooh, it's part of a plant. Where did this plant come from? Let's do some investigating. It's green. It kind of looks like a flower. And it has a little bit of a purpley red edge. Do you see which plant this came from? Does this look like the same plant? It does. And this is a succulent, so I can just put it in the soil and it'll eventually grow roots as long as I keep it watered and it'll grow a new plant. I love succulents. And if you love our channel, please continue to support us, tiny fans. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. It's very easy and push the link below. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we're excited to open a new toy. And they're nesting doll sock monkeys. And they've got little fuzzy real yarn hair. So we're going to open them up and stack them together. All right, so we've opened up our little sock monkey dolls and now let's count how many there are. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now this monkey is the smallest and usually the smallest little uh, monkeys or dolls in a nesting set don't open. But what I like about this one is it does open and it's so tiny. So there's not much you could fit inside that little monkey. And see how they all have different faces? Happy monkey, confused monkey, happy monkey. This monkey's winking. Uh, this looks like maybe a scared little monkey. And this little monkey just got a brand new tooth. There we are. So the sock monkey toys on the box of uh, the sock monkey set. There's a sock monkey stuffed animal and there's also some sock monkey babies and a sock monkey jack-in-the-box. Well, we have two of these toys we're going to show you. Hello! <laughs> Here's our little sock monkey stuffed animal that we have. We also have our sock monkey jack-in-the-box. Let's wind it up and see our monkey come out. And there's our sock monkey. Hello, little sock monkey. 
Let's put our sock monkey back and close the lid. Don't come out, monkey. Stay in. Oh my goodness. There, sock monkey has been put away. All right, so now that we've checked out our toys um, relating to sock monkey, we're just kitties checking out the new uh, dolls here. Hey kitty. So let's put our sock monkeys together. So we'll take the smallest one. And kitty likes the little yarn. Cats seem to like yarn. Oh, don't eat the hair, kitty. Oh, kitty, don't eat the hair. So we're going to put this little monkey inside here. And then we'll go to the next one. And the next one. And they just stack inside of each other until there's only one left. And so that is our nesting doll sock monkey toy. So thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we're very excited to open up our new Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer nesting doll set. Let's open the box and have a look inside. Oh boy. So our first nesting doll is the little dentist elf, Hermie. And Hermie's holding the little polka dot elephant. Now this little nesting doll is the smallest, so it doesn't open up. It's gonna go inside. Who's this? <gasps> Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Hello, Rudolph. And let's see which other characters are on this nesting doll. And we've got Yukon Cornelius, the fellow who helped Hermie and Rudolph along their journey. And the last nesting doll is my favorite. And it's the snow monster. And he's lost his teeth. So let's put our nesting dolls inside one another. So let's open up Rudolph. And put the little elf inside. And Yukon Cornelius. They're beautiful wooden. And we want to twist it to line it up. Ooh, little squeaky. And last but not least, we'll put this one inside. This abominable snow monster. And there we go. And thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we're going to open our Santa nesting dolls with our Hey Duggy toy. Let's start by opening our biggest nesting doll. Ho, ho, ho! It's Santa Claus and he's holding two candy canes. He has a big beard and mustache. Let's see what's inside. It's one of my favorite Christmas ornaments. It's made with such detail. It's an old fashioned popcorn maker. It looks like real popcorn is inside. Hot buttered popcorn. Next is our snowman and he has a carrot nose. He's holding a Christmas tree. This Christmas ornament is one of our Disney princesses, Rapunzel. She has a purple sparkly dress and she's wearing a cloak to keep herself warm since it's winter time. Here's our little penguin and he's building an igloo out of snow and ice. Oh, look at this glass ornament. It's a candy jar with sticks of colorful rainbow candies inside. Mm. 
Next we open the little elf. He's carrying a gift. It's another Disney princess. This time it's Anna. And unfortunately, Anna's head came off this year, so I had to repair it with some glue. And she's as good as new. That rhymes, new and glue. Our next nesting doll is a reindeer. It looks like Rudolph because he has a red nose. Inside Rudolph is a Santa Claus. This is the Santa Claus from Rudolph. Ho, ho, ho. And he is carrying his big sack of toys. And now we have a little drummer. And it's a little tiny pink candy ornament and it shimmers with sparkles. And last we have our little teeny tiny polar bear. He's so cute. I can't imagine an ornament would fit inside of this one. It's the last piece to our nesting doll set. It's a red bird called a cardinal. And we've opened each nesting doll. Now it's time to put our ornaments back on the tree. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Tiny treasures. Today we're, we're gonna hide one, two, two three, three eggs. eggs, and we're gonna uh, hide, hide them five under five boxes. One, two, three, four, five. Who's on the boxes? Eagle, Pickle, Maca, Paca, the Hahus and the Pinky Pong, and the Hahus. And the Ninky Nook. Abracadabra. Eggs hide under the boxes. They're hidden under the boxes. Let's find out where they are. They're just nesting. No, not under there. No. Under there. Yay, we found it. Who's joined us? Cat. Kitty cat. Hi, kitty. <gasps> We've got a fairy. Ooh, she's pretty. She has a crown and a magic wand. Let's find another. Let's see under this box. There's one up there. There is one. Kitty wants to smell the egg. Smell the egg. Put it up, Kitty. Let's see. A mouse. Squeak, 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 squeak. We have one more egg to get. <gasps> it's under Macapaca. This egg. It's. It's a little Yoda riding in a little spaceship. Ship. And thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today I'm going to show you my Russian doll set. And so this one is a very old, so I'm not going to just open it today. Okay? So here's... What? Oh, so they can cut apart it. There's a little baby right here. 
I gotta put it back together and see which side goes in which one. This would be easier than it was. my Russian outfit. Thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Goodbye and please subscribe to my videos.